Good evening. One man is dead after an explosion last night at a parking lot in Timmins. It took place in the Schumacher area and forced police to evacuate a hotel and some other businesses. Their investigation continues as CTV Sergio Orangio reports. Mining blasts are common sounds here, but what people reported hearing Tuesday evening was far different. One hotel guest says she and her family noticed sirens blaring while out at dinner and then returned to a frightening scene. You know, they said, oh, look, somebody's in trouble. And I, oh, I feel bad for them. <laughs> Who knows? It would be something like this. There's just so many lights, you couldn't really figure out what was going on. Relocated to another hotel, Jan says she was told not to look out the window when collecting her belongings, but that it was clear police were cleaning up a mess of debris. Officials say the explosion happened at the west side of the hotel's parking lot, and they found a man dead near his vehicle. As investigations progress, they say it's not yet clear what happened or whether the explosion was intentional. Intensive uh, investigation will reveal the size, type of substance that was used to be detonated in this explosion. We expect that a postmortem will be called for by the local coroner's office to determine the identity of the person and the exact cause of death. The hotel and adjacent businesses are closed for the time being. Visiting from southern Ontario to reconnect with relatives, Jan says she certainly didn't expect a welcoming like this. It's a very scary situation. I don't think I've ever come to anything this close before to something like this. And uh, I'll think twice before I come back to Timmins. Not wanting to reveal her identity for fear of potential danger, Jan's hoping for more details and says she appreciated the supportive police response. Officials don't suspect foul play. We are performing a thorough exam of any CC television equipment in the area that might give us a better time frame or the actual interactions that led up to this event. Until the investigation is complete, police ask that people avoid speculating. They say it appears to be an isolated incident with no further threat to the public. Sergio Rangio, CTV News, Timmins.